Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Travis. Uh, today's video, I'm going to show you guys a tip slash trick uh, that I've done with my return lines to prevent the water from siphoning back into the sump when the power goes off. Now, you can do this even if you have check valves because check valves do fail over time. I have two of them on the system and I do this regardless and uh, it's definitely prevented water from coming out of the sump and flooding my basement. Now, I'm just about to do the very first water change on the 300 since I finished the overhaul. Now, there is a couple more videos coming out in that series which I'll finish up this week and you guys will see that. But uh, yeah, so let me go ahead and show you that trick. Now, it is pretty basic. But basically what I like to do, and basically, basically, is keep saying that, is I buy, uh, for this lock line here, I always buy the longer sections. I think this one is, I don't know, like 10 inches. I guess if I could stand up high enough, I can measure. But either way, uh, it's about 10 inches or so. Um, and I've taken multiple uh, sections of this and put it together. Now what I like to do is I bring it up over the top of the water surface here, and then I bend it. I'll show you guys on the tub here a little bit easier. Um, so I'll bring it up over the surface. Oh, the big birth is scaring the shit out of me. Jesus. Anyways, <laughs> so I'll take it up out of the surface of the water and I'll bend it at the top and have it pointing down. So what happens is when the flow stops, instead of it siphoning into the uh, return line back into the sump, it actually has to come up out of the water, which breaks the surface there, and then uh, breaks the siphon and then it goes back down in. So yeah, that's kind of what I've been doing for a while now and it works out pretty good. And I do have check valves, but as I mentioned before, they do fail. And where, where are you at, B? Where you at, Big B? Why you gotta scare me? Why you gotta be like that? Hmm? Yeah. She's hungry. I gotta feed her. Anyway, she, let me see if you can pet you. Oh, she wants to get a nibble. Okay. All right, Sharkosaurus. All right, anyways, but uh, yeah, so this video is all over the place. Anyways, uh, so yeah, that's what I do to prevent the water from siphoning back into the sump. It's a pretty easy, basic thing, and uh, yeah, so that's it for this video. I'm gonna finish this water change, and uh, glasses, pretty dirty. Pretty dirty. Peace.